Deb Turner with My1053 WJLT, and I'm here at the refinery with yeah. owner Debbie Rhodes. Hi. Debbie is the owner here of the refinery, which used to be the former Newburgh Country Store. This is brand new to the refinery. Debbie, tell us about your new ice cream shop, I guess, right? Well, it's a new, adi a new addition to the refinery. Uh, we've been here uh, not quite two years, and we're a work in progress, but we're really excited about the addition of our ice cream. And our ice cream is handmade and hand churned in Mount Vernon, Indiana by Bliss Artesian. And he brings it to us on a regular basis, so it's always fresh. And he truly, his ice cream is a work of art. And you'll see that as we go over some of the different flavors that I hope Wait. you'll want to sample. I want to sample them all. I don't okay. know which one to start with first. I'm a, I'm a lover of chocolate. Oh, okay. First and foremost, and I see you've got some chocolate in here, but yes. I, I'm willing to try something new. So okay. well, what should I start you with like, first? Well, since you like chocolate, yes. first of all, let's have you try, and this is going to be a little bit different for you, Deb. So are okay. you ready? I'm ready. Uh, I would like for you to try the dark, dark chocolate Cayenne. So is this going to be like hot, cold, or? No, it's cayenne's not. Cayenne's kind of like Now this is yeah. really dark chocolate, Giardelli chocolate. Oh my gosh. Very rich, but just kind of put it in your mouth and okay. and uh, a little hint of cayenne. But let me know. you got to wait for it. Just a little bit. What do you taste? I taste chocolate. Okay. Just rich kinda... chocolate. And now it's coming. Holy moly. Not too not too much heat though, But is it's it? not too bad. I know. Now it's, no, the, it's just the cayenne is kicking in now. It's really good. I'm and surprised. Different. Yes. yes. Yeah, and for people that thought? don't want that kick, we have the chocolatey it's chocolate. Really good. Or we have Mississippi Mud, which is out of the case right now because it's like one of the top sellers. So we're always changing. Yeah, tell us about that. Like, like, how often will I see these same flavors here? With like, when they're gone, they're gone, and you bring in, we, or he brings well, in. Well, we have a freezer. He okay. has forty-three flavors. Wow, forty-three fabulous flavors. I there's none. There's there's not one that I don't love. Okay. Um, or that I don't like. So what we do is when one empties, we go to the freezer and bring out another one. In fact, that brings me to maybe you would like to try the spiced rum raisin. <laughs> I'll try it. Are you a raisin yes. lover? I love raisins. I've got some at my desk okay. at work, just like sitting there okay. at my desk. So I, well, it's, I it's love Friday. Raisins. The raisins are soaked in Captain Morgan's. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to try this. Mm. Who would have thought that would be delicious? Okay, good, right? I love that. Okay, let's not stop yet. The vanilla is delicious, by the way. Yes, it has a great ice cream base. It's not um, going to get me drunk, though, Sam. No, but, no, no. All but, of that evaporates out. But I thought you might like that for Friday. That's delicious. You know, it's 5 o'clock somewhere. I, you know, I wouldn't, wouldn't have tasted that if, if you wouldn't insisted for me to try that, but that is really good. Okay, I think maybe you should try uh, the pecan pie. Pecan pie? Okay, yes. then I want to try some more because that looks good, too. Okay. Okay, pecan so pie first. Pecan pie. Let I me tell you about pie. the pecan pie. Okay, tell me. This tray actually has a half of a pecan pie in it. It. it does? Yes. Mm. So when you're getting that dip, you are getting goodness, oh my pecans. Heavens. This is delicious. This does taste like a, a pecan pie with ice cream. Okay. Delicious. Okay, just put those mm. in here. We're not Thank finished you. yet. Mm. How about the s'mores? I highly recommend all three that I've just tried. <laughs> you may try the s'mores. Mm -hmm. Yes. And the s'mores, what I love about that, in the ice cream base, he actually torches the marshmallows. Really? So that they have that, uh, like, uh, toasted, taste. toasted, along with the chocolate and the graham cracker, and then the, the base of the ice cream. Mm, look at that. And I have to say, I don't like s'mores normally. You don't? No. I'm a weirdo. I don't like s'mores. But I love that ice cream. Love I love ice cream. this s'mores. I can taste the crunchiness of the graham cracker. The chocolate. I can even taste the uh, like the toasted marshmallow. Just yes. right now. Just Very right now. Good. It is really good. So the s'mores high on my list too. Mm. Okay. How about a red velvet? Can I show? Okay, I want to try the red velvet, but I want to look at this fried corn. Yes, I was going to I have that never too. ever heard of fried corn ice cream. I can life. say never have I had corn and ice cream. But I've think about your best corn casserole. Maybe at Thanksgiving time or something. And let's just sweeten it up a bit more. 
Never and heard of fried corn ice cream. But it looks like it's your big seller here because it's like it almost has. gone. We just put that in and it's gone fried down corn. very quickly. Oh my heavens. And I love corn too. I can't believe how much that is so good. We had a second grade. That's very sweet. That very good. Ate a whole regular size of it because we love corn so much. It was his favorite That is one. really good. I wouldn't have tried that, but I do like that. Very good. It looks like your best seller here right now. Well, they're going down. They go down really fast. So, um, how about peanut butter and jelly? Do you like peanut butter and jelly I love sandwiches? Peanut butter and jelly. PB and J is peanut butter with the grape jelly. All right. Okay. So um, you'll find that it tastes like probably just what it is. But okay. So the gentleman who uh, makes all this ice cream is out of where? Mount Vernon, yeah. Indiana. Mm. Oh my God, that is so good. <laughs> and you can I also have, have any of these flavors put in a cone, or you can have them in a cup. Mm, uh, we have the small, regular. If you want three of them at a time, we have a trio sampler. If you want two regular scoops, you get this size. Or if you want to take it home and enjoy it while you're watching a movie or whatever, you can buy it by the pint. Okay, now, do you have anything larger than this, Debbie? Like, if I want to take a quart of ice cream, this ice cream home, can I do that? I would give you two of those. Two of those? Yeah, that would, okay. yeah that's the biggest size that we sell. Okay. At least at this point. Because you know a lot of people will probably do that. I know. Well, just like, I want to take some home. It it's could so be cute. up and coming. We so I guess you can make that. you can make floats while uh, I... Yes, we are able to. We have our vintage refrigerator back there. It has the vintage sodas in it. We let them go back, pick out their favorite uh, vintage soda. Maybe it's a root beer, a limoncello, uh, an orange... Um, like a dream sickle. That sounds good too. Uh, and then they pick out their soda. Okay. We put their ice cream. They get to pick out what kind of ice cream they want. Be as put, creative as they want. Put a big regular scoop in their cup, pour the soda in. Okay. And then we let the ice cream rise, float, right. That's and then put in a little bit more of their soda and give it to them and they can enjoy the rest. That sounds good. And then they've got cones too. Yes. So you can get a float, you can get a cone, you can just uh, eat it out of the cup. And you can take some home. Yeah, on Saturdays we're having a special and it's called the Love Boat. Um, what it is, is a donut bank donut. Oh, I love donut it already. Yeah, a donut bank donut. Okay. And then what we do is we let you pick out your favorite scoop of ice cream. Okay. Now we also have maple bourbon bacon that makes it into the case. So say for example you choose that. Then we might put a little maple syrup on it for you. Okay. So you've got the donuts, you've got your ice cream, you've got, you got your syrup, sugar, either yeah. chocolate or maple syrup. And we call that the love boat because we know you're going to love it. <laughs> that is awesome. That is so great because everybody loves donut bank donuts. And they this do. ice cream really is amazing. I've never heard of this before, the Bliss Artisan Ice Cream. Yes. Well, this is a good thing that's going on here at uh, the refinery with Debbie Rhodes. And uh, we thank you for letting me try all this wonderful ice cream. Thank you for coming by. So you need to stop by. What are the hours here that people can stop by to sample your ice cream? We're open Monday through Saturday, 10 o'clock to 9 o'clock at night during the summer hours. So the evenings, it really gets busy. People are sitting out on the porch, up in the loft, you know, outside, just walking along the river. It was a perfect time to get started. Awesome. So while you're here in Newburgh, it's on Jennings. It used to be the former Newburgh Country Store. Stop in here at the refinery. Try this ice cream. It's the Bliss Artisan Ice Cream. Delicious.